Well, hello there and good day. Thank you for joining me. I am Frost PDP and today we're playing Crusader Kings 2 Robber's Revenge episode 56 according to my count and things are going well on my end I'm just conquering some enemy lands and um, Yeah, that's what we're doing. All right conquering enemy lands I found an administrator or rather an architect to put him in charge of the siege of Rowan Hopefully that's finished soon, and then I can just knock knock Tini Revolt out, and not have a problem. Duke of Aragon is prisoner of King Tello the Bastard. Aragon. Well, whatever. I don't know. I don't care. Imprison some peoples. Patroth can marry. Yes, you should marry. A uh, hundred gold or some prestige. Prestige is nice, but I don't really need it. The gold, on the other hand, pays for stuff that I can build. Like, good thing I've been a little lax in this in neighborhood. I'm trying to pump up my retinue right now. Now my son is French, so that's good. He's an adult. That's good. He's craven and misguided warrior. That's bad. Whatever, he's not gonna be fighting any wars. Oh wait, yes he is. You want to marry my niece, Princess of Wales. To your random person, your son. But you're a pagan. No. Uh, I have an ingredient to my treasury. Sure. Enhance my experience, game. Uh, you initiate, you use Bezios' greedy sloth lady who deserve none of the riches in his possession. What do you say, brother? Shall we raid his laboratory and claim that which would be ours? This shouldn't be a mission. This is like a dickhead thing to do. I mean, is he a greedy, slothful idiot? No, he's not even a greedy, slothful idiot. He's none of those things. I decline, because that's mean. It's time for the ritual has come, and your order is so, um... My character studied the stars, so let's look at the stars. Let's see what we get. That means you're encrypted by in the pursuit of astrology in many forms, with ample time spent mulling it over afterwards. I believe I've deciphered what it meant. I look forward to putting it to good use. Uh, that didn't go well. My nephew has requested to join the Knights Hospitalier. I bet I had a better idea. I bet you get laid. Bring some land into my dynasty, why don't you? Is this was still folded yet? Not yet. The steel is going to fold very soon. Maybe it already has, and I missed it. Yeah, they only they only pressed Astorius. What are they pressing now? Nothing. They're yeah, working down to the 159. Keep at it, Castile. Be a good buffer state. Just when we had a Reconquista going, we were one province away from an AI Reconquista. Count Bellin has provided. I don't care. Don't care about that either. I fully occupy the county that I wanted to take. Well, looky here. Uh, after the council meeting, the court chaplain asked me to change a few words in private. Apparently, he's uncovered a rumor regarding a rare artifact. Good idea. Go look for it. Truly, this can't come back to bite us. Clicky. Is it telling me like I haven't won a battle or something? Cause I can control all the land. But I'm guessing because I haven't had a battle with him, I can't really do much. Go 
Titanium Revolt. We just beat off Octane a little more so they don't think that they can get out of this war. We captured a bishop. I can ransom the bishop. He gives me money. Seventy-six, seventy-eight. Unless this guy knows how to fight a war, he's really not bothering with me much. Well, not Aquatine, but the other one. I have no time for dreams and rumors. Uh, Duchess of Auvergne. Good for you. City, I'll click the button. It's a church, I'll click the button. Anything that speeds this war up. Speed is sort of essential here. Force demands, force demands. Thank you for rowing. Disband just the troops. Bring the men back over here. Time to press Denmark. <sighs> Please don't see my troops and run like a motherfucker. You don't see this army marshalling for you. It's kind of big. Okay, sure. We'll make it even more men. What should we do? I have to do all the work. 13 war score, 0.6 military attack. that. Byzantines are a war for rum, I'm assuming. Charsinian. Seljuk Revolt, huh? That'd be an awfully good time to declare war on them. But we can't. Well, the Aztecs have taken um, all of this, I guess. A war that happened so fast, I didn't even notice. Second invasion of Andalusia. I guess then he won the first one. Jesus, how weak, how fast was that over? Uh, we're in trouble here. Then spawned 13. We got a Christian defensive pact, maybe, against the Aztec Empire? Just a thought. Give me at most 76% the size of him. But I have half the troops. At least there's a substantial defensive pact against him. And me, but also him. Are married to my nephew. The King of Wales. That's non dynastic, so actually his heir no 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 no. You freaking moron, you married her? Maybe I did that to him. But I didn't expect him to inherit. Well, now it's an absolute must. Why the fuck is this against... There's an empty seat on my council. Stuart, well that's a problem.
gift. He's not of my religion, he is a Cathar. So there's is an artifact hunter, right? How can I tell? Freaking kidding me, I need money, man. So I've gifted the minor titles, people. Uh, and the rest are actually too strong to even think about really gifting. So do I just buy favors then? No. You're just gonna have to be a different religion. It's okay. Got a lot of bullshit going on in my empire, don't I? I think trade practices should be probably a thing I buy. Alright, so there's a land from Aquitaine. What else do we need? We're gonna need Denmark. We're gonna need it. Let's bring one over. It's fine. Bringing two over should solve this. Temporarily cynical. I don't get it. Why does it matter? Yes. Yeah, okay. All right. Oh, I can pick an ambition. What would my ambi oh P? No, no peace. Expansion is the only way. And Denmark. Claim Denmark for this dude. It'll become a theocracy. That's fine with me. Declare war. Uh, I don't want to spend any of my own men on this, though. Z raises the troops. C raises the boats. V puts the men on the boats. Z C V Z C V Z C and, you know, stand that down then. I'll raise my own boats when they're all there. Great Holy War for Norge fails. That's fine. G 
Um, alt. Well, first let me raise my own boat. Then alt. Oh, no, should be. Yeah, thirteen thousand. Drop a thirteen stack right on your capital. That sounds fun. This will jihad for Arabia. She has 12,000 troops. I shouldn't underestimate her too easily. Well, hello. Look who doesn't want to go down without a fight. CC. V. Uh, yeah, try to kill my wife. Go ahead. Good luck. Planes? Yeah, he's the best guy to put charge there. He's also a great guy to have in charge there. I'm not sure what they're thinking. Guess they're trying to get up the morale advantage on me, I don't know. Uh She needs to stay out of this one. So that was a big battle we just won. Uh sixty three percent war score, three point one military attack. And that click the button pretty much pain free. Neat little trick I just used there. The whole strategy was I lured her into a land battle, I took her on head on, and now she's got all of her top holding provinces, which is her strength exposed, her army's cut in half, I just ferried men over, and it cost me a little bit of gold, but in the end I won battles. Castile has usurped Valadoid. I don't really care, do I? Castile's in enough trouble. You know the Aztecs can barely take on Arabia. It's like, okay, sure game. She had actually five capital level holdings. It's pretty good. One, click the button. Um, yes, phone, we know. My true friends at the castle of Rizgay, they uncovered an interesting relic. I got a skull trophy. What the hell does a skull trophy do? One stares into the empty socks with this subtly human skull is not uncommon to experience both fascination and revulsion. It is a reminder of our impending death that was some a satisfying deed. Original owner, Dugarn Fast the Weak. Well, he was certainly weak, alright, he had beat. I want to order my army to go across, and with that I want to thank you all so much for joining me. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like and subscribe buttons. It really does help my channel out a great deal. I really appreciate it on a personal, deep level. It's like I check and I see like, oh my god, there's more subscribers, I feel good about my life, even though it's just such a minor part of it, for now anyway. Uh, and as always on this channel, La Paz.